Welcome to Ruger Tech Tips. If you have a Ruger single action revolver and you put a large number of rounds through it, time for a good cleaning. I'm going to show you how to do that today. First you'll need to make sure the revolver is completely unloaded. Just open the loading gate and check each and every chamber to make sure there's absolutely no ammunition in the revolver or in your cleaning area. All you'll need for tools are just some basic gun oil, a solvent, a cleaning rod of some type, uh, a small brush, a, a bore brush, the appropriate size cleaning patches, as well as an oily rag, and just a, a rag for cleaning, and a good workspace. And of course, a pair of safety glasses. Now to begin, I'm going to remove the cylinder. And if you have difficulty removing your cylinder from any of your single action revolvers, we do have a tech tip video on that. To start with, I'm going to clean my cylinder out, and I want to get some solvent inside my chamber. So I'm just going to put some solvent on a patch and run that through each and every chamber just to get that starting to clean. Once I've done that, I'm going to switch over to uh, a bore brush that I can give that a pretty good scrubbing out. Again, I'm going to put some solvent on there and just run that back and forth in each chamber uh, enough times to make sure that you get any kind of the residue, debris, what have you, out of those chambers so it's nice and clean. And then it would go through a follow-up of going back in with another patch, a dry patch, clean that out and see what it looks like. See how your patch comes out. If your patch comes out nice and clean, you're good to go. But keep redoing this process until you end up with clean patches and you can visibly see that the chambers are clean. So I'm just going to run a patch through and see what that looks like. Yeah, run that, dry all those chambers out. And just basically keep repeating this process till you end up with the clean patches coming out of your cylinder. Now, for the main revolver, uh, we're going to do the same basic process that we did with the cylinder, is I want to get some solvent inside the bore and I want to get some solvent uh, any place where there's, there's powder residue, the back of the barrel, the, the breech area of the revolver, those areas, I want to get some solvent in there and get that starting to work. So I'm going to run that through the bore. And I'm also going to get some down inside my frame and give that a pretty good scrubbing to get that cleaned out. I'm going to run that through. Once I've done that, I want to get into that bore with a solvent wetted bore brush to scrub that out as well. And I will do this a few times to so get all the debris out of that bore. And then I will go back in with a dry patch and see how well I did on Then I'm going to go in with a, with a rag, wipe off any excess solvent debris, dirt, what have you. Once I'm satisfied that everything is completely clean, I will just take a, an oily rag, put a very minimal amount of oil on that, get that starting to soak, and then I'm going to go back through my chambers and bore and put a really, really light coat of oil on everything. And again, I would do a minimal amount of oil. You want some, but a very light amount of oil. Don't don't put too much oil on that. So just a light amount of oil through the bore and then each chamber. Once that's complete, I'm going to reinstall my cylinder. Oh, I want to get the inside of this nice, just a light coat of oil. Just wipe everything down, light coat of oil. Again, don't, don't go too heavy on the oil. Just a small amount is all that's needed. 
Congratulations, you've cleaned your Ruger single action revolver. Thanks for watching this Ruger Tech tip.